Hello, it's uh, five and a half weeks since my operation to remove my kidney. The analysis of the kidney is complete. It was a 9.5 by 9.3 centimeter tumor in my right kidney. And the kidney size is typically about 12 centimeters. So therefore it was the most part of my kidney was a tumor. Probably been there for a year or two years as a minimum, according to the surgeon. It's a clear cell carcinoma. And on the Leibovitch scale, which ranges from zero to 11, one to two being low risk, three to five being medium risk, and five and above being high risk, my risk of return of cancer metastasis is eight. I've only been able to identify on the internet and through talking with Macmillan Cancer some papers and to identify and, and try and get a, a better understanding of what that cancer risk means. It appears uh, from what I've read that the return of cancer is very likely in my in me because of the scoring. And what I don't know is when. In the study, in the information I've seen, uh, almost nine out of 10 people with a score of eight or above have cancer metastasis throughout their within 10 years. And I don't know whether that onset is in one year or five years or 10 years. So there's quite an unknown. I'm waiting for the oncology department to make contact with me to discuss that score and programs that are running to see whether or not I'm minded to participate in the trials that are currently underway. The side effects of the trials may be a reason for not participating as, as I've been advised that there is no current spread of the cancer. The surrounding tissues revealed no evidence of it. So at the moment I'm cancer free. My physical condition is getting better every day. I've been encouraged now to get back to my normal um, sporting activities, albeit I need to start gently because uh, my activities are quite high octane windsurfing, surfing, mountain biking and running. Um, so I've been jogging as a way into sporting well-being and I've been doing some very uh, specific and structured Pilates, um, both of which have helped me gain confidence in my physical condition and build some uh, strength and resilience. I've got quite a long way to go. You may be able to see in my face I've lost weight um, uh, six or seven kilos probably over this six or seven weeks. Uh, half a kilo may have been the kidney itself, but I've, um, I'm under, under muscled, if you like, compared to where I've been in the past, but I can feel it will come back and I will see a specialist regarding a, a regime of rebuilding to get me back to the levels that I'd like to be for the future. So as far as the kidney surgery is concerned it's complete there's been no recall i'm not under the control of those the urology department anymore i've been referred to the oncology department and i'm now waiting for the oncology department to contact me to discuss the options and uh, my status so until i have that correspondence and conversation with the oncology i won't have any more to report other than I would hope uh, an increasing well-being and, and return to full physical fitness. The external scarring is no longer a, an evident a worry to me at all. And um, fatigue levels, I'm, I'm okay. I don't need to sleep in the afternoon. So uh, nearly, nearly six weeks on, five and a half weeks on, I'm feeling quite bright and, and really quite positive about the the short term future and and looking to make some plans to maximize my well-being and uh, enjoy as much as I can while I can and uh, wait to see what the oncology department suggests and what journey I go on with them. Uh, that will be the next update. So uh, hopefully this uh, adds to the previous two videos and gives anybody who needs to see the kind of timeline this is my story and I hope it's been beneficial to you to see it unfolding.